Hello YouTube friends, Alicia here with another, sorry, I was just turning off my um, floor here. Um, another video, this is another junk journal I've made. I am in a different location. I'm in my big craft room because for like the first time ever I have it clean. Not my desk per se, um, but my floor is clean. So I have been working in here. I actually like my little craft room better because it has more of my basic um, crafting supplies the my big craft room has like a lot of the bulk stuff so you know my paper um not my papers uh like my junk journal papers not my scrapbooking paper or anything like that and it has like my books and mixed media stuff but anyways all that to say I am in a different room I'm very happy it is clean I have some more work to do but yeah I just wanted to show you a junk journal that I have been working on and I'm gonna say this as well, and I don't normally say this, I don't really like this journal. It kind of went from bad to worse, but um, I carried on and I got it finished and I'll use it. There's nothing wrong with it. Um, it's just, it wasn't what I had planned. So anyways, it is a signal signature journal. It has started off, I want to use this coffee package from... Um, Panama that my friend brought back for me. I mean, she brought me back the coffee, but um, I kept the package and then it, I put it on the cover crooked so that didn't help the matter. And then, yeah, I just went from bad to worse. I don't mind this here. This is just, this flower is from um, one of my friend's weddings and it matched, so I did that. So, and then, yeah, sequin trim on the side and it's just an envelope. I've used old scrapbooking paper that I've just had sitting around, kind of cleaned off my desk. So for that, I'm happy. Um, fabric flip on book pages. This is my own scan. I like this, but I can just rescan it. So um, this is a bag that I cut in half. I used some different printables I had printed. That. Um, this is from Tsunami Rose, a cluster I've made. I've been showing these on my channel. Uh, that's just penny printable. Little pocket with a die cut in it. And I'm really annoyed because I misplaced this die. But anyways, hopefully that shows up. I'm not thinking it will. I will probably have to replace it. More images from that's just Penny. My next journal, well, I don't know if it'll be my next one, but one that I'm working on um, is using her Easter kit. So I will talk more about those images and things like that then. Just a bag I added. Same thing. And this as well, the spring came from that's just Penny. Just a sticker I had. More ephemera. Photo frame. I'm not liking the setup with this camera and tripod. Um, this is a paper clip that was altered that somebody gifted me, so I just added it there and then I'll add pictures. A piece of ephemera. So I I don't really like this journal. It doesn't have a theme. Which is really odd, because I normally really like eclectic, but this is just not... Whatever. I think it's gonna be ha it will make me happy when I start using it, because it's eclectic, but it's not making me happy right now. This is a stamp that I have, and I just um, wanted to see how it's stamped out. Little bunny sticker, a tag somebody made me. Another one of my clusters. I do like my clusters. So, that's a good thing. Oops. And I used, I've had this ephemera, these ephemera pieces for ever, and I actually made a shaker. I'm going to make a card, I think, out of this. It's not centered, but it's still cute. Um, and I've always did, kind of debated, do I keep them, do I get rid of them? It was one of those, like, cutesy kits. But I just started adding them in this journal, so if I start writing in this journal um, soon, it's kind of the right season. It's going into spring. We'll see. I need to finish writing in my other journal. 
that I've been writing in for like two years because I don't write very much. Um, an envelope pocket. It's And then it's the pocket on the top here. I need to paper clip this in. I like this bag. Um, I just altered it with a filler print that somebody gave me. And um, a tag that somebody made me. As, and then I just um, added this tag and a tag topper. So I am using up things that people gave me. This is fun. This was just um, an envelope, not an envelope, um, part of the master board that I cut in to like a pocket shape. And this was just um, scrap that I had of one of my printables that I made or whatever you want to call it, scans. I put acetate here for a picture. I am huge into taking pictures, not so much into scrapbooking them, so I'm more likely just to stick them in a journal, so there's that. Um, another image from the kit from That's Just Penny. This is also That's Just Penny. I love the bunnies. Back of that bag, which I don't think I even opened, but that's okay. I can add pictures or I can open it or do whatever. I like this. I thought that was cute. Little t um, it just flips up on both sides. Um, it's not really a tuck or anything. It's just decorative. And that's a cupcake liner. I've had them forever. Fabric flip. I like the fabric. Um, I got it from work. I have a bunch of fabric scraps, so I need to incorporate them in my journals. Little envelope that I just made into pockets and then added stuff from that's just Penny. Well, that is from her. Um, this is, I don't know where this is from. Um, this was fun. It's just folds here and then opens here and folds down for writing and then a pocket up here. Like I said, I was just using up things that were on my desk and that I've had in my stash forever, which is like this paper. This is actually cardstock, but I'm not going to actually make a themed journal, most likely to use something like this. Um, possibly cards, but I'm happy to have it in here. So, and then this is the back and this paper is something else I've had and didn't know what to do with. So, um, I made this little journal. I hope you like it. And any questions or comments, leave them below. I'll talk to you all soon.